to St. James Digital Sunday School for Sunday, April 12th, 2020. Happy Easter, everybody. Jesus Christ is risen. Hallelujah. We have spent the last 40 days avoiding that word. Hallelujah. Lent was a time for mourning because Jesus died, but because it's Easter, we know that Jesus is alive and with us, and so we shout, Alleluia! Let's learn more about this happy story from the Spark Story Bible. It was early in the morning on the third day after Jesus died. The sky was pink and red with the first light of the sun. The women didn't notice the sky. They hurried to the cave that contained Jesus' body. Mary Magdalene and Mary, the mother of Jesus, led the way. Two others, Salome and Joanna, carried the spices to rub on the body of Jesus. They had an important job to do. When the tomb of Jesus came into sight, they froze. They had forgotten about the huge stone that sealed the opening to the cave. How would they move it? The woman kept going to the cave anyway. As they came closer, the woman could see that the stone had already been rolled away. They peeked inside. It was empty in there. Jesus was gone. And then an angel appeared in sparkling white clothes. The glow of the angel brightened even the darkest corners of the cave. The woman shielded their eyes from the blinding light. Don't be afraid, the angel said. Jesus isn't here. This is a place for the dead. Jesus is not dead. Jesus is alive. Hurry, the angel said. Go tell the disciples. The women didn't wait. They ran to tell Jesus' friends what they had seen and heard. Mary bumped into a man, tripped, and fell at his feet. It was Jesus. Hello, friends, Jesus said. Jesus was really alive. The women hugged his feet and shouted with joy. Go, tell the others the good news that I am alive, Jesus said. I will meet them in Galilee. I can't wait see them again. The women had a new job to do. They had to tell everyone Jesus was alive. This is the best news anyone could ever receive. The women going to the tomb were extremely sad. Imagine they were going there to mourn their friend who they thought was dead. They were getting ready to prepare his body and put spices on it in order to honor him. But when they arrived, they were brought to the happiest place you can possibly be. Their friend was brought back to life and he proved himself to be the son of God who he said he was and that he came here to save us. And not only was Jesus alive again, they were reaffirmed that their faith in Jesus was right. He said he was the son of God and that he would rise again from the grave, and he was. And so that means when he said that he was here to save us from all the things we do bad and to bring us to heaven with God, that's what he was here to do, and that's what he is doing. Do you guys know what Alleluia means? It's an exclamation of joy, a happiness that comes from deep, deep down. That is why, at this time of year, when we say Christ is risen, a lot of times we'll yell back, Alleluia! Sometimes we'll say, Christ is risen indeed! Alleluia! Just to hammer home the point that Christ is alive and with us even today. Let's try this out now. I'm going to say Christ is risen, and I want you to shout back, Alleluia. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Christ is risen. 
That was great. Now, let's have a few discussion questions. Have you ever had good news that was so big that you couldn't help but share it with everyone? What would you have done if you were one of the women that was at the tomb and then you saw the angel in the cave? And lastly, what do you do to celebrate Easter and the fact that Jesus Christ is alive with us? Now, we're not going to have an activity today because I'm sure your day is going to be full of celebrating Easter. Before we head out, let's pray. Dear God, Thank you so much for the gift of your son, Jesus Christ. Thank you so much for the promises that he gave us and that he was brought back to life to save us. Make sure we know that you are always with us no matter what and help us to share the good news that Jesus Christ is risen. Alleluia. Amen. I hope you all have a happy Easter and a very blessed week. Mm -hmm.